bit overcast today, but still warm enough for ice cream. So I'm here on Baldwin Street to check out Arctic Bikes for some sweet treats. So the place is a bit unique, it's very different. It's not your typical ice cream. It is shaved ice cream that is rolled up. So this one is a Thai, I think it's like a Thai tea. And then the other one that we got was a coffee flavored ice cream. I can't remember what the names were, but they were very tempting. And this one has got grass jelly, it's got waffles. It smells really good, but they're very flavorful. Like this really does taste like Thai milk tea. Yum, very, very good. fairly warm now and it's perfect for some ice cream so we're going to check out Scream for some of their offerings. So they got some really cool flavors in there. We've got like this double scoop, I've got cotton candy and I've got birthday cake and we've got some other fun stuff here. But then also they've got these gluey flights. The benefits of a hot summer day is that you get to cool down with ice cream, but then also at the same time your ice cream melts a lot quicker. So it's a bit messy. You guys know I don't like getting my hands all sticky, but... Did a bit of a detour. I went to I Hill Crunch. I got hungry, so I was eating it. They have a black on black ice cream. It's like a charcoal ice cream with charcoal waffle comb. They have different flavors as well. Got the ube and strawberry and charcoal. I think that one is black on purple. I can't remember, but they're very good. It's one of my favorites, but also your tongue is black. Today it's a bit warmer, so we're gonna go check out, I think it's called Butterbaker. So they have like seasonal flavors. This time they have got the mango, which is really flavorful. And they top it off with this really cute mango on top. But the lineup is very long in there. But just be cautious of that if you're gonna go in the summertime. These are so delicious. So for this ice cream, we are in Uptown and we went to Buya and we got these ice cream tacos. You get three different flavors, it's kind of like a sundae. We've got like lavender honey here, cinnamon toast crunch, and we also got this Biscoff which is really good. It tastes like that Biscoff cookie. Okay, this is a lot of ice cream. The three scoops is a very filling. And then we actually ended up here in front of Dutch Dream, which is another ice cream place just down the street from it. We're probably going to check this out some other time because they've got some also very unique ice cream concoctions. Back at the area, I'm going to Dutch Dreams to check out their offering for ice cream. Ooh, I've got crazy hair right now. This is what I got. It has some kind of black cherry and this, I don't know what it is, it's like a vanilla with cookie batter and something else. Finally had a chance to try it. It is a peanut butter brittle vanilla and that is black cherry with cotton candy on top. If I was to rank these, I'd say I Halo Crunch and Butterbaker are my favorite for taste, Booyah when it comes to value for money, Arctic Bites for texture, and Scream and Dutch Dreams with presentation. But overall, they each offer unique flavors and different experiences for whatever type of frozen treat you're looking for. Plus, they're super Instagrammable. Go check them out, give them a try, and let me know what you think. Enjoy!